subscribe our channel and press the bell icon never miss an update from tech hunter hey guys welcome back to my channel tech hunter and in this tutorial i'm gonna show you how to fix the application was unable to start correctly 0x0007b problem this problem can be happen with you when you open any games or editing application etc let me explain what is the reason of this problem if you use old version of windows and you're gonna install latest version of any software then this problem can be happen with you and this problem not only for Windows 7, it can be happen with uh, Windows 8 or 10. So let's see how we can fix this problem. So I'm just close this image. First open a browser, which one your favorite? And here search for download DirectX. Here you will get a lot of websites links. You have to open Microsoft website. You can see web address top of the link. So I'm gonna open this second one. It's from Microsoft website. So just open it. And here you will get download option. Click on it and download will start. It's very small file so download it quickly. After download it then open it and install it. Agree with your terms and conditions then click on next. It will take some time for installation, so wait for it. Make sure you have connected to internet for proper installation. After you complete it then just click on finish. And hopefully your problem will be fixed with these tricks. But if still showing this problem again. Then here search for .NET Framework and here open this link from Microsoft and download from here latest version of framework. Here our first one is the latest version. So just click on it. Then click here for download it. After download it then open it. Uh, here agree with their terms and conditions then click on next. It will start installing. Make sure you are connected to internet, it's just like before. It will take some time for installation, so I'm just close this tab. I have already installed this application and I have already fixed my problem. So there are no important to install it again. After install it properly, hopefully your problem will be fixed with this trick. If you success to fix your problem, please comment in this video. To get more this type of videos, don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe our channel and press the bell icon. Never miss an update from Tech Hunter.